Happy Friday, Oak Ridge. Uh, thanks for hanging out with me today. Today is Friday, January 28th. And what a week we've had, a little week and a half of uh, delays or cancellations. Um, I think we'll probably see more of that uh, as we go through the next month. Um, but uh, appreciate all the flexibility uh, from our teaching staff and associates and adults here in the building um, and kids and parents um, as well. I've got uh, a few links in here that I'd like you to take a look at if you have not already. Um, and the first one happens to be the Return to Learn plan has been updated uh, based on our school board meeting uh, from, uh, from Monday this week, excuse me. Um, so take a look at that. And I'll talk about a few changes and just some, just some reminders. Uh, first reminder, as if uh, your child is, is ill, uh, just make sure they're staying home. Contact the health office and make, stay, make sure they're staying home. Um, if you happen to get them uh, tested for COVID, um, please keep them home until um, after the, the results um, are there and then we'll, uh, we'll kind of go from there. Uh, the communication from me, uh, if we have a positive case in the building, um, has changed. Um, I, will then, I will just be sending an email to uh, the entire grade level and say there was a positive case in seventh grade or there's a positive case in, in eighth grade. So that is a change and I've done that a few times uh, this week already. Um, so kind of be look on, on the lookout for, for that change. Uh, the biggest change we have is when students can return uh, back to school if your child has tested positive. Um, and uh, previously it was a 10 day uh, quarantine and now it's going to be just a five day and kids can return on day six and days six through 10 while they're in school, um, they will need to be masked. I have a link um, uh, that, you need to, that you can check out with this as well. When you talk to the school nurse here or wherever, whatever building, um, they'll give you all that information, um, we'll count down the days, let you know when your child can come back and then how long they need to wear that mask while they are in the building. So that's been a, that's been a, a change uh, uh, that we just experienced uh, on Monday. So take a look at those two links. Uh, be sure to reach out if you've got further questions uh, based on that. I wanna talk about some athletics and activities that I've been um, had the pleasure to, to watch over the past couple weeks. Um, we had a vocal concert um, in the past week or so, wasn't able to be there. Was at the band concert this week, it was great. I was actually there for the fifth grade through eighth grade um, uh, band, so uh, hats off to uh, Brett Dupre and Steph Nuss for um, having a, a, an excellent show um, earlier this week. Orchestra concerts coming up, um, uh, I believe in the next week or so, um, early February. Um, and um, I was in the classroom yesterday and, uh, and watched some, some seventh graders and uh, I'm really excited about the show that they've got coming up. Uh, so thanks to Ms. Skylar Rachel for um, uh, uh, putting that show together. I was at the girls basketball game uh, yesterday. That's winding down. I think girls basketball has one more um, game early, early next week. Boys swimming uh, finished up yesterday with their conference meet and wrestling's getting going. Talked to a few wrestlers yesterday. They had a great practice. Um, it was a couple girls actually. They're very excited that uh, girls wrestling is, is getting larger and larger here in the state of Iowa. So real excited for them. They have a wrestling meet coming up um, that first full week of February um, as well. Seventh grade uh, students, we're gonna start homework club next week. You should have received an email parents about homework club. Uh, just an opportunity for kids to stay around with teachers. So teachers will be available for um, that extra help um, as well. Uh, and then to end today's show, just want to congratulate our Lego League. Third place champions award um, at the state uh, competition this past weekend. Uh, congratulations to Kathy Becky and her team. Uh, great job, represented Oak Ridge uh, very well. Third place finish is fantastic. So congrats to our uh, Lego League champions. That's all I've got. Uh, happy football Sunday. Can't wait to watch a couple of games. Have a great weekend. Take care.